Hello, this is Scott Dahman of Power World Corporation. Here I will demonstrate the use of the Transline Calc Transmission Line Parameter Calculator. The calculator may be used as a standalone application or from the Edit Mode Transmission Line dialog within Power World Simulator. To use Transline Calc from within Power World Simulator, first switch to Edit Mode. Select a transmission line from the One Line diagram or from the Model Explorer and show its dialog. From the Parameters tab, choose Calculate Impedances, then From Conductor Type and Tower Configuration. The Power World Transmission Line Parameter Calculator is launched. Next, we specify a conductor type. Many conductor types, usually named for birds, are predefined. Next, select a tower configuration. The tower configuration defines the spatial relationship of the three phase conductors. Transline Calc comes with only one predefined tower configuration called default. It is easy to modify the default configuration or to define other configurations. Here, I could define a new configuration for a 500 kV tower. Next, I define how the phases are oriented on the tower. I can choose to specify the spacing in either English or metric units. On the right side, I define how the conductors are bundled. For example, I could specify three conductors per bundle spaced a half a meter apart. Next, I'll save the configuration. Now, I can select this new tower configuration for my transmission line. Next, I'll specify the line length which may be done in either miles or kilometers. The power, voltage, impedance, and admittance bases are all automatically populated based on the power flow case and the selected transmission line. The lumped transmission line parameters are then given on the right side of the dialog. The lumped results, as well as the line length, will populate the parameters for the current transmission line record when we close the dialog. You may also view distributed parameters per unit mile or kilometer and intermediate calculations for both the distributed and lumped parameters. You may also edit or create new conductor types and specify their characteristics. You may also specify the transmission line thermal limits in amps or MVA. Transline Calc will automatically provide the conversion based on the voltage base and populate the limits for the selected transmission line record when you close the Transline Calc dialog. Finally, there is a tool to estimate the conductor type if the tower configuration, the line length, and the lump per unit impedance values are known. The tool will provide a measure of which conductor types most closely match the parameters. This is a standalone tool and does not impact the specification of the current transmission line. When we click OK to close the Transline Calc dialog, the length and the per unit impedance parameters are automatically populated based on the results. If you adjusted limits on the AMP to MVA conversion tab, those MVA limits will also be shown. Outside PowerWorld Simulator, 
Transline Calc may be launched from the Start menu. You may enter line parameters and calculate impedances, but the results are not linked to a line within a power flow case. In standalone operation, you may also edit or add conductor types or tower configurations for future use. If you have questions, please contact us or browse the transmission planning resources on our website.